Hey friends, today and due to the travel bug, we are doing an overnight in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. And we're looking for a unique boutique hotel stay with a playful design. And that's why we're checking into the Hotel Monaco, Pittsburgh. So, where are we going today? We are going to Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Why? For fun of it. We're going to go stay at the Hotel Monaco, Pittsburgh. Oh, those are nice. Aren't they? They are our favorite luxury brand of hotel, I think, Kimpton. Nice. All right, you guys ready? Yeah. It looks ready. <laughs> All right, let's go. The Hotel Monaco Pittsburgh is located in the middle of the downtown area. Hotel Monaco's are part of the Kimpton brand of boutique luxury hotels, which is part of the larger brand IHG. Being part of a brand, you would expect cookie cutter chain hotel stay. But the only thing Kimpton hotels share with each other is their approach to luxury. They like to say they provide white glove service without the white gloves. They're not a stuffy luxury brand. Hotel Monaco and Kimptons are fun and they're uniquely different while still delivering impeccable experiences. So when you check into the Hotel Monaco Pittsburgh, um, there's complimentary wine at the front desk and We've noticed since we've been here, there's little touches of bird theme throughout the hotel and it's really cute and I appreciate all the bold color choices and patterns they used. Um, this is a fun hotel, we're excited. Alec, can I see the view? Wow. So I love the bold wallpaper choices everywhere. Um, Kimpton's just such a fun, fun brand. Um, they don't take themselves too seriously, but it's still very luxury. And I like to judge my hotels by their shampoos and conditioners. This is eucalyptus, lemon, white flower, sandalwood, orchid, mandarin, citrus body wash. <laughs> oh, we'll do one more. Basil, green apple, sandalwood, cardamom, geranium conditioner. So they're in the big bottle, so you feel too bad to steal them. So <laughs> and um, over here, let me show you something fun. It's a closet, and it's the little touches like this. This is just the wallpaper in the closet. Isn't that amazing? I want to do my whole house in that. These curious bird touches is a playful wink to the city's hockey team, the Penguins. Did we find a lot of bird themes in this hotel? Yeah. Plus this. Anything else? Chicken feet. Chicken feet. I want chicken feet. Oh, that's weird, huh? Chicken feet chandelier. So dinner tonight's at the hotel. Um, luckily we're staying on the top floor, the ninth floor, because that's where our restaurant is. Beer garden, it's on the roof. So it's kind of a nice casual um, dining experience with kids. Uh, they have a more formal uh, restaurant downstairs, but with kids, this is just more fun, more relaxed. So here we go. Thank you. Uh, it's very airy, <laughs> uh, very open, open design concept it seems, uh, no, it's very nice, I like it a lot, really cool, cool buildings, yeah. and good drinks. What did you think of our hotel today? I thought it was great. It was amazing. There's only one thing that made me disappointing. What? It had no swimming pool. What's a oh. hotel without a swimming pool? Yeah, swimming pools are kind of deal breakers for kids, aren't they? 
It was still a fun trip to um, Pittsburgh, huh? Yeah. Let's get going. All right. For more unique travel shows, like and subscribe to see where Doodlebug goes next.